Fuck it, go, you pint-sized prick! You, you little... Fuck out of here! God! Man, I'm sick of driving so slow staying with these fools. Can we have a... a real race? Yes? know that voice. You're that Johnson's Johnson. Molly Schultz, Senior Vice President and General Counsel to Devin Weston's Holding Company, if that's what you mean. Oh, keep talking. I'm enjoying this. Let's assume you're talking about the cars. Bring them to Hayes Auto on Little Bighorn in South L.S. Mr. Weston and I will meet you there. Don't hang up. I, uh, I think I love you. Devin's lonely lawyer says go to Hayes Auto in South L.S., so that's where I'll be waiting. We'll see about that. I vote we indulge his childish need to play. Besides, it's his head... His head on the block if they get scratched. Gentlemen, I love you all. Oh, God, this is gonna be fantastic. One kid and two old creeps. Who the fuck would have thought it? Gentlemen, move the vehicles. Hey, give me five, five, and five. Oh, hey, chest kiss, homie. Boom! Dog, come on, man. You got the fucking paper? Absolutely. Look, you finish the job, you get the paper. But the order was for five cars. If I'm not mistaken, that's only two. Just give me the fucking money now! Oh, I'm so scared. I really, really am. But you know what? Work type of guy. 
You don't like the job? Take a fucking walk. Hey, come on, man. Hold on. So what's next, man? Well, it's the Z-type. Chad Mulligan. Lay it on him, kid. Mulligan's a record producer. He's going through a messy divorce. He's hiding his valuable assets, including the car, so that makes it complicated. He'll clock any ground surveillance we run. All we've got to go on is that the car's in a lockup in Howick. So we just go house to house? Not quite. We have access to an LSPD helicopter. The computer on board can ID pedestrians from a chip in their driver's license. Find Mulligan and Howick, follow him to the lockup, someone on the ground collects the car. All right, so who does what? You're not needed for this job. Phillips, you're in the chopper. Clinton, you're on the ground. Yeah, I, uh, I don't understand the deal between you two. Yeah, well, I don't understand the deal between you two either. But you know what? Life! It's just one long mystery. Bye-bye, gentlemen, and stay spiritual. Oh, and Michael, I'll be in touch about your friend, Solomon. All right, good. <laughs>